name is Shushmita. So recently I had moved to a new job and it's it was just one and a half month since I started my new job. So the team had planned for an outing on Saturday. And uh, Saturday is, it's my commitment to come to the church because I have given my commitment those Saturday and Sundays where I have to be here available for God. And um, since it's a new job, they insisted me to come because I was new there. They wanted me to mingle with the a team and everything but I didn't want to go so the whole week I was praying that like something should happen that I would I shouldn't go to this outing or whatever and on during the week I was talking to my mother and she said you know what God will make a way you'll end up not going and that's what she said and I was like okay fine and Friday uh, there were some banners sent in the group where there's going to be some election rallies happening throughout Bangalore. And I was so happy that they're going to finally cancel the outing. But they didn't. They were like, we'll start early, we'll come back early. Then I was like, God, what to do right now? Because there's practice also. We had moved the practice to 7 o'clock. And it's not easy for the entire team to go back and come again on Sunday. It will be very tiring for all of us. And I was just praying, and correctly at 6 o'clock in the evening, I started feeling feverish. And I was not worried or anything. In the moment I felt that I'm getting fever, I was like, praise the Lord, I'm sick. <laughs> and I was so happy, and I, I, I just texted my manager saying that I, I won't be able to make to the outing. And, you know, uh, one of my colleagues, he just said, you know what, I know you're making this up because you don't want to come. And since it's 40 kilometers away from this place, so traveling 80 kilometers, I was like, I don't know how to come and all that. So they were like, you're just making this up. You didn't want to come. And I was like, God, what is this again? So they will not believe me. And this fever became so severe that I ended up in going to hospital. So usually I don't go to hospital even though I'm sick. But it became so severe. So I have the doctor's prescription to prove them that I was actually sick. And I, my BP, everything was low. I was under medication. I was all of that. I was very sick. I was not able to walk also. I know most of them have seen me yesterday. My condition was pretty bad. And there was a, a leadership uh, program happening for all the workers. And like I wanted to be here no matter what. My condition, my health, I, I just did not care. I just wanted to be here. I was sleeping in the mother's room. I was listening to what pastors were talking and doing here. I was just listening. And when the choir was worshipping, even I was worshipping. I was sleeping. I was not able to sit because my whole body was... It, there was a lot of pain in my body. I was sick. I was so weak. I was not able to stand or even talk to anybody. So during that time, my I had severe headache. The headache just went. And then after some time, we had practice. And we were singing. So I was not able to stand also for the practice. I was sitting on the chair and I was practicing. And we were sing, practicing this in control song. So during that song, when we were singing the chorus, I felt the presence of God, you know. It says, uh, like, you know, he's in control. And tell my soul again that he's in control. And he knows everything. He's the Lord of all. So even in the sickness, there's nothing that can enter my life without the knowledge of God. And he's still in control. And he knows what's going to happen. And I had that assurance and pastor prayed, pastor ma'am prayed, the team prayed with us. And we went back home and I had something and I was sitting in my bed and looking outside. It, some worship music was just playing along. And I felt the presence, like pff, it just fell on me. And like, I was so weak. There's nothing, I, I couldn't feel the weakness in my body. I was completely healed. There was no weakness. I was able to walk. I was able to dance. Immediately I got up and I started dancing because I wanted to be here on Sunday with full health. And today I have, I'm here with no sign of sickness in my body. And all glory belongs to God.